Hey guys, this is YT42 and welcome back to uh, the uh, video game marathon. Otherwise, um, Super Mario Bros. Uh, 3 on the GBA, part 9, 8? No, 9. Uh, 9. Yes, 9! Down it. Um, in this episode, we're gonna cover World 7. And let me just say this. World 7 has good levels at times, but honestly, most of the time, they're just annoying. Um, like one of them, where you have to use this elevator thing, and you have to, if you jump on it, on certain elevator, um, it changes direction. I'll tell you the level when I get there, and wow, that was a really stupid move, my day. Um, so, yes, yesterday I did, um, like, for the World 6, I did do all of that. Um, like, everything, editing, filming, everything yesterday. And that was an afternoon, it took me about, like, two hours. Two hours for a video, not too, too bad. Um... Uh, yeah, so I guess, yeah. Uh, here we go, we're into the level. Um, think about World 7, it's a giant pipe maze. Yeah. So, look at that, look at that, there's pipes everywhere, and you gotta travel through them, just like in World 3. Which can get really annoying at times, it's not too bad, if you don't mind wasting your time. Only a couple seconds, but yeah, it can get annoying. Although, I do like the overall design of this world. Pretty cool. Uh, and by the way, today I did do all of World 7. Um, yeah, today I did do all of World 7 and did like the recording, the editing, everything. And this commentation. So, yeah, another. Two and a half hours, I guess. It's not easy. And tomorrow I will publish World A because I want to get this um, game over with because it's such a quick game. I mean, it'll only be what ten parts. Then, um, so in two days I will upload. Oh, by the way, in this level you want to keep the fire flower. I didn't know that. that I didn't remember that. Uh, a raccoon leaf being there, but um. Anyway, yeah. In two days, expect Sonic Colors again, and you know, uh, it'll be Planet Wisp. Um. So yeah, and then after Sonic Colors is finished, then I'll do, um, oh, uh, Sonic Adventure DX. I've already said what I was thinking, um, about with Sonic Adventure DX in the last video, but I'll just say it really b briefly here. Um, originally with Sonic Adventure DX, I was only going to show the Sonic levels, then I decided I would do the Tails levels. And now, since it's a video game marathon, I decided that I would just get rid of all the, all the stories. Um. Oh, and this is just a fun fact. Um, fun fact, but this is weird saying this over a Mario game. My favorite Sonic game is Sonic Adventure 1. Not Sonic 2. I, like... I'm sorry for you haters out there, but I do not like Sonic Adventure 2. That's probably because I've got the battle version, I haven't got a Dreamcast for the original, but I just don't like it. Besides some of the music, like City Escape is just, yeah, you know. But I, I just, like, um, I enjoy Sonic levels and Shadow levels, but then again, they can have really bad control over the you can have really bad control over the characters. Take City Escape, for example, um, with Sonic. In the beginning, that skateboarding section, I always have the hardest time trying to control 
as long as I when that happens. Oh, and this level is a really hard level, so it's, so you should bring either fire, either a fire flower or a frog into here. I decided frog since I didn't have a fire flower. And there goes my frog shoots. I hate you. Fish! Did I? Run? You know what? I'm going to you know, rant about what I just said there. Um. Up here is the the uh, swarm of jellyfish, and they can get really annoying. Oh, and as you might have already noticed, in this um, world, I I use the I abuse the uh, replay feature again. Um, but uh, yeah. That's because the levels are getting harder, and I have to fill them over them a lot. Um, so, World 8's coming out tomorrow. Don't, don't, don't worry a dang bot about, about that. Um, yeah. So, yeah, this level is hard. Um, <laughs> that just seems so funny. Uh, yeah, this level's so hard. Anyway, we beat the level. And I did it one in one try. That's that's pretty cool for me. Um, plus, I was recording, which is even harder. When I got this game, like, years and years ago, uh, I hated level 4. I hated 7 to 4. It was... Uh, I hated it so much because I didn't know that you should bring uh, a frog or fire power in. Um, thing about this level is uh, I just take forever doing this because it's a maze here. It's not really a maze, just it's not easy. Great, you can talk to me. Um, Nothing much else to talk about. How about I uh, talk about um, this uh, w this world? So I, I really like the design, like the early world design of the um, of this world. It's really cool. I like how it's just a bunch of islands and um, and. Since I've I've been raised in Australia, I love islands because they're just part of my natural home. Um, but I don't know. I always like that island feeling. It's so nice, peaceful, warm. Saying that in the middle of winter over here, but who cares? I'm like someone who stresses so much about winter because it's so depressing and boring. Because I can't really get out in the urban and film. Um, which is really annoying. Because if I, so, like, in winter, um, in winter I actually think that I can make through this uh, <laughs> a little often. Um, but, yeah, I can't really get out and film in winter because, well, it's not as humid as it would be in summer. Um, so that means, like, no Hype Mario Bros. Uh, Aqua the Dog, but that would have to be inside. Um, but not, not in the middle of the video game marathon, I won't mention this stuff. Uh, how you get up there is... You gotta run. I'm not going to say anything about that. Alright, so you gotta run and jump over there so you get enough momentum and to jump over. And let me just, uh, as I've said before, this level gets really annoying really fast because it's just a maze. Um, so yeah. And then you go down this pipe, and ooh, why not? 
And of course I got back up for it. Because I just have to waste time. Alright, 10 minutes in. It really feels like it's been 5 minutes. Um, yeah. So let's go back up. And I didn't actually mention in my video game marathon Pokemon Ruby. But that's because I want to take a break from like editing and editing. Because you know, on Pokemon Ruby I make sidebars. And that shows my Pokemon. But if I finish the video game marathon, um, I will continue to do Pokemon Ruby. But, um, yeah. Um, about the new game. I don't, I haven't really got any ideas. You guys tell me, do you want a console game? Like, as in TV? Thing or a handheld. I would actually prefer, like, yeah, I would actually prefer um, console because it's easier to do. Um, but it's up to you. You should um, tell me the system. Like, you should tell me a uh, console or a uh, handheld. And, uh, yeah, go ahead. Ooh, I actually have a really uh, good idea for the console one. Yeah, that's, really, that's a really good idea. Um, see these piranha, these piranha things? There is plants that like to chop your head off. Uh, yeah, they're actually mini levels. And what I mean by mini levels is that they're not actually levels. They're just things that if you get through them they're incredibly short if you just get through them like see this is the end already you can get a prize and I thought my frame rate was going crazy right there but anyway see you can get a prize and then I got ooh, ooh. that's special this castle I hate this castle and I also love it because you can get so many coins, but you always want to bring in, like, a Tanuki, a P-Wing, or a, um, or a, uh, what's it, a, uh, Raccoon Leaf. Simply because, um, sure, this looks, this looks easy. Like, I can hear you saying right now, why do you, but... But we don't need it. That was that. You just need a bigger Mario. Uh, no. For see that pipe up there? Yeah, you gotta fly up there. There you go, you people. Ooh, that's a cool background. But is Mario really that tiny? Anyway, uh, it's just another one of these. I really gotta find out this thing's name. I'll have to look on the Super Mario Wiki, and of course I get hit. Uh, there we go. A little clear. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to get this game finished and Sonic Colors, of course. But I feel sort of weird not doing Minecraft creations, or at least Minecraft, because I haven't done anything else in a while. But of course, I, I should get away from this, from that stuff, because it's sort of too big, if you know what I mean. Um, I don't like, th this is the elevator level that I was talking about earlier. I hate this level because of its gimmick, these elevator thingies. Look what you gotta do to pass here. You gotta jump so it goes left, and you gotta jump again so it goes up. Then you gotta jump again so it goes right, and then you gotta jump again so that way it goes up. Yeah, I, I feel hey. I feel pain. And then I just go this way because it's a bit easier avoid because you get more time 
And be careful that you don't jump too early because that way you can um, be walking on those spikes. But even if you do, you can still jump up um, from those spikes. Right, level cleared. Um, so down this pipe. And let's go on to this next level. I think it's level, yeah, it's level 7. So let's just say there are four, um, five aisles that have levels on them. First one has level 1, second one has level 2, third one has level 3s, levels 3, 4, and 5. Uh, fourth one has uh, 6, and yeah, just 6, and it has a castle. Um, I mean a fortress, sorry. And it has, uh, and then, um, the fifth island has levels 7, 8, 9, a castle, and the, I mean, a fortress, and the airship. So, yeah. That's the second, um, uh, five, I mean, three stars. But, um, I, I know how to get that. Uh, really easily. All you gotta do is keep running, like at max speed, so you're... Yeah, I can't say that with a straight face too well. I cut that mushroom house out. But you gotta be running full speed, and then you gotta jump into the... Like, you gotta jump into the... Box that'll give you the token, or... Not token, why did I say token? The panel, or card if you're playing the NES version. Um, and that'll give you a star no matter what. Oh, that was cool. So, there you go. If you need extra lives, there you are. Alright. So, this level sort of feels like a mini level even though it's not. I love how I keep hit, hitting things in pipes. Um, and here we go. Behind the level. If you can keep this up long enough, you would have a star or something. Because look at this, I cannot get behind the level in time. You gotta memorize the level so well. You know, I don't really think it's possible. No, I don't think it is. Oh, those those um little chompers will uh spit a bunch of fireballs. So yeah. Wait, that reminds me. Fire yum malt. <laughs> oh man, I was in that uh, mushroom house and I got the tanuki suit, so that's how I have it for this level. I don't get it. Why is this a desert level? Oh, and this is also a maze, except it's above ground, which isn't so depressing. Um, geez, Mario must be hot under there. With all that, with that, with that. Sleeve and everything. He, he's, he's got fur on! I just made that sound really long. Well. Then I get I said it's hot under there, so I really can't blame myself. Well, yes, I can. Twice. But, um, yeah. Let's uh, keep going through here. And this is just. Well, it's not, it's not really too big a pain. All you've got to really do is just trust your gut. And there we go. End of the level. Do 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 No, I mean... Do 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 Is it just me, or does Mario's mustache, when um, he's in the Tanuki suit, get bigger? I don't know, it just does. I also hate this uh, fortress. One, that thing, that thwomp that crushes you really easily, because it's a hard pipe, pipe to uh, avoid. Um, the lava that's on the floor. And the pipes that are covered in piranha plants. And they are only, look. 
Look how cheap this is. Um, and some of the bur and some boos come in. They might not seem like much, but and this pot. Um, they might not seem like much, but they can be. Oh, and uh, I I was trying to knock out this bar this uh, barns by uh, flicking the flicking the tail, but I missed. And yeah. And look how cheap this is. I'm gonna do that. Duck on duck. Not get hit by the flying pancake with dimples in it. Um, but yeah, I'm surprised I survived beating that. Um, but yeah, I don't like this uh, fortress for uh, all those reasons. And this is another mini level, sort of weird putting it right before. Right before, oh, pardon. Right before a um, fortress, a uh, flying airship. I'm not. I muddle up my words a lot. Um, anyway. So, you come down here and I think it's a mushroom that I get? Yeah. Nothing big. Well, it can actually be really useful if you think about it. And also really useful if you're playing Super, new Super Mario Bros. Me. But that's for another time. I like how when you beat the game, like, I swear, Lost World, the uh, king was a Yoshi as well. So, I like when you beat the game that the kings turn into Yoshis when they've been transformed. Um, yeah, let's just keep, let's just keep moving on. Uh, yeah, these are these screw things again. Just do what I do if you don't want to die. Um, if you're wondering who is at the end, it's Ludwig. Ludwig. Uh, yeah. He, he's that, um... Oh, he has that weird last name. That middle name. Ludwig von... something. I don't remember. I haven't been doing my Mario research in a while, so... Did I just... Did I just slide into that guy? That, that was sort of weird. But anyway... Um... Oh, and this is just a random thing that I want to say. But, uh... It's really random this, at this time. But, Sonic Colors... Uh, I think Sonic... Um, is a bit more flexible on the DS version. I don't know, it's just me. Probably because I love Sonic Rush. For some reason. But, um... Anyway, I, I just... I don't know. I, th I think he can... Tr he's um, a bit smooth and flexible on that one. Probably because on the Wii, um, he, uh... Like... He, he, there's too much 2D platforming and there's not much 3D stuff and there's a uh, like lack of boosting. Uh, anyway, I want to tell you this thing really quick. Um, if you beat um, any Koopaling with a uh, power-up suit on, like you still have it and then you come back to the king, he gives you a different message. It's a nice little easter egg. Um, I don't think I'll be, I don't do that in this, uh, let's play there, sorry. Oh, splendid, splendid, I'm back to my old self again. Thank you so very much. Alright, so, that's it. Hey guys, this has been YT42, and I'll see you guys next time. See you then.